when he was a young warthog. When I was a young warthog! Pumba, sorry. You know, some people work from home and I work a lot from my driveway. And that's just, that's hard to explain to people. So I don't. Lacuna, batata, tomato. I haven't really on like the, the old school Disney songs kick lately. I got through a whole week of work at the dog daycare and they did not mess up these nails. Now how? Oh no, I, there was one dog trying to bite my nails. That means I did good. I had to do everything daintily calculated. I said, no, 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 no. Speaking of work, uh, my friend and coworker Lauren, her birthday's tomorrow. I don't know why I got this idea. I was like, I'm gonna <laughs> give her a bunch of things that start with like C, like a theme. I got her a blanket for when she's like, wants to feel comfy. I got her like this new craft, you know, the diamond, I think it's like diamond painting where it's like the glue, you like glue things down. It's like these mini coaster sets that you can make of these designs. And I don't know if she's ever tried it before. So I was like, oh, here's a, here's a craft for when you're feeling crafty. This good powder cheese that you can put on popcorn. So I'm going to get her some popcorn. So like when you're, when you want some crunchy. So I'm going to the dollar store to pick up the last little bits of it. Chocolatey stuff. Yada, yada. Who is emailing me? I mean, who, who is emailing me? Oh, it's, shut up. This is good timing. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Jerry just texted me. Jerry, who does my graphics. He just sent me a coffee run. Okay. A coffee run logo. I'll put it in. Boom, bam, shabba pop pow. We have a logo. Now it's official. This is a series. <laughs> it's not a series if it doesn't have a logo, apparently, on this channel. Good timing, Jerry. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so I need to go to the dollar store to pick up the last little bits of her gift. And then also we're going to go to Starbucks and try the new lemon. Is it pineapple? Is it a refresher? Is it a passion fruit? Is it... I know it's a liquid drink. That's about all I know. And I know a lot of people get them and they look yellow. We're going with a yellow liquid. That's not P. We'll have to just see what they say. Oh, also, let me throw the car back and park. I don't know if I'm allowed to tell you yet because it's not my information to tell. Like, I'm related to the information, but it's not my direct information to tell. But if I put it in, that means I'm allowed to tell. My niece was born. Woo! My niece was born. Yeah, two days ago? Yesterday. Two days ago. March 28th. <laughs> I gotta remember that birthday now. She's happy, healthy. Mom's happy and healthy. They're home. Saw a video. Jamie got to meet her. My mom, her grandma. See, now we're getting confused. The fam whole family tree. My mom was over there watching Jamie. Um, and she just got back. She's exhausted from taking care of a toddler for a couple of days. She's snoring on the couch. And Riley's right there with her. My baby niece is here. Her name is Allison. I'm probably gonna call her Allie. Because my old roommate in college, her name was Allie. And I like the name. Allie. But yeah, everyone's good. They're back home. I don't know when I'm gonna get over to see her i also want to like respect their space like i don't think you need your crazy aunt tt all up in your business you're two days old like <laughs> i'll get over there sometime to see her and that'll be fun and then there'll be two of them running around apparently she's like super blonde my mom was like you can't see her eyebrows she's so blonde you like can't tell she has eyebrows and i was like i don't do babies have eyebrows most babies don't even have hair like what if a baby came out and had super pronounced on fleek eyebrows and you're like hey What's, you got a beauty salon in your hoo-ha? What, how, how, how did that? Just no hair, but thick eyebrows. Okay, well, that's gonna be studied. Cause how did you do that? <laughs> how did you pull that off? I was like, I don't think babies have eyebrows, mom. Like, <laughs> you know, I don't have a baby of my own. I don't see too many babies on the regular. I don't think that, should I just Google, do babies have eyebrows? I just get stopped on the street by one of those people who do like random interviews and they're like, what's the last thing you Googled? Do, do babies have eyebrows? I just want to know in case I'm ever in a bar playing trivia and they go name something babies don't have. And I'm like, ding, ding, ding. Eyebrows, my guy. Anyways, yeah, so <laughs> I'm officially in an ant to dose. No, 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 no. I haven't been to the dollar store in a couple of days, so I got the itch. Wait, I wrote a song the other day about the dollar store. How did it go? We're gonna go down to the dollar 25 store where we will take your dollar, where we will take your dollar and you holla, holla for that dollar. Ooh. Also, there was a toy that my sister-in-law said, if you see it, I should buy it for Jamie at the dollar store. It was like a car wash. He wants a car wash toy. I could do that. My anxiety is always through the roof 
because I film these videos on Thursdays. Oh my God, don't riot in the comments. I have to film them on Thursdays because they come out Fridays. So obviously I'm not filming them on Friday. I'm not like traveling forward in time and filming the videos on Friday and then zipping back to edit it and then to put, I'm not, this is not a time travel channel. It's a coffee run channel. What was I getting at? So I film a lot of these Thursdays so they can come out Friday. Whoopsies, peek behind the curtain. Nobody get mad, it's the magic of YouTube. I'm pretending today is Friday. I always have like such bad anxiety on Thursdays. Who knows why? And then filming these usually helps. Not gonna lie. I can't wait to mosey on around the dock. Do you guys have a store that you just like to mosey around? Some people hate shopping. Detest. I don't, I'd rather sit in the car on a hot day with the air off than go inside the store. We get it. I feel for you. Make sure you have water and a puzzle to do or something. A Sudoku, a little game on your phone. Is there a store that you like to mosey around in? Some people like hardware stores. Some people like comic book places. Some people like chocolate fact. Well, not the factory. Some people like chocolates, candy stores. Chocolate factories? Yeah, I just like to mosey. I just like to put a hair knot on and mosey on down the chocolate factory when I'm bored. What? Okay, Willy Wonka. You know, is there a store that you guys like to mosey on around? For me, it's not a craft store, not a Michael's, not a Joann's Fabrics because my mind starts turning and I start taking pictures of things that I want to buy but I'm not going to buy. And then I think about how much, you know, how much that costs and when am I going to have time to do the craft? No, I like the dollar store do a little people watching, walk the aisles. There's only like five aisles in a dollar store. So you could snake around that and be done in 10 minutes if you wanted to. You take your time, take a couple laps. You go 20, try on some of the sunglasses. Look at some of the, the snack foods, you know, see if they got any new crafts in the arts and crafts section, which is about 10 feet wide. I just like moseying around, dilly dallying. I cannot believe I'm an aunt to two. I have a niece and a nephew. That's nuts, crazy. Cuckoo, who am I? It'd be funny if I put this whole gift together and I just never explained to her, like it all starts with a C. I don't know why I picked C. I'm not, I didn't do it selfishly because my name starts with a C. It was just like, it came to me. So many adjectives, comfy, creative, cozy, crafty, uh, uh, convenient, uh, cerveza. That's beer in Spanish. Is the dollar store popping off today? What y'all doing? Is there a big old smudgeon on this camera? <gasps> you joking. What is this? Mark on the camera. I just smudged it even bigger. Y'all gotta give me a break. I need to get a cloth. Let's go see what kind of financial trouble I can get into. <laughs> I just said wrap it up. I'll take everything. <laughs> when is Easter? Because the Easter stuff was out and about and it has been before and I wanted to decorate the cactus tree and I picked up a couple of things for Easter. Mm, 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 mm. And Riley's birthday video, I did the egg hunt for him and I do it every Easter. All of those Easter eggs are cracked, bro. He cracks them with his mouth. And then I'm, you know, putting reds with the blues and the yellows and I'm just like, whatever. So I was like, if I ever see really cheap Easter eggs, I'll replace them. These have like little designs on them and then these are just they're like little bunny faces <laughs> it'd be a funny video of like one of these just like sitting in the yard and Riley just comes he's like Rrr. oh happy easter and then they had little gold ones so i was like yeah get him some gold ones this will be like the wild card this is the basket i'm gonna put her gift in popcorn chocolatey <laughs> that's a toy for my nephew it was sitting right on top it was calling me they just had an l and i was like all right that was meant to be so i got her that stuff i got her a card i done did pretty good now let's go to starbucks and get this drink Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Is this Starbucks closed? There's no one in line and there's no cars in the parking lot. What's going on? Y'all throwing a surprise party? Where is everyone? I don't know what the new drink is called. We have to wing it. We cannot be prepared. We're going with the flow. Everyone ready? Everyone places, places. I will a Starbucks for you. Hi, can I just do a grande of the paradise drink Starbucks refresher? Cool. Thank you. You too. This is so not a problem or like a me problem or like a it's not anybody's fault problem. I've had such a hard time finding places to film the past two days. Yesterday I went to go watch my friend's bowl and I was like, I'm going to eat food in my car before I go in just because I'm starving. I was like, let me park far enough back in the parking lot so that no one just rolls up on me stuffing my face full of food. The car pulls up here. Car pulls up there. The people get out of their car. I look up and a family of four has gotten in their car in front of me and they're just sitting there chilling. They 
refuse to leave the parking lot of the bowling alley. They're just like, look, kids, a late 20-year-old eating in her car. You see this pretty often, but no, look at her. Look at her technique. She shovels the food in her mouth without doing much chewing. I felt like I was in the zoo. I was the subject of a National Geographic photo shoot. Just, I got blocked in by cars. And the person next to me parked so bad that I just kept looking over and I was like, you're not even in the lines. And then I just tried to park over there to film this. And I pull up and I see a girl going like... <laughs> And I was like, oh, she's crying. Oh, we got a crier. I'm catching her on her worst day. And I'm two cars over just like, look at my drink from Starbucks. I moved over here. <laughs> Listen, I'll give it to Starbucks. I don't think I use the word pretty a lot for drinks. This one's kind of pretty. Cloudy, orangey, yellow. Little ASMR with the nails. Smells passion fruity. Smells like, you know how Starbursts, the, the tropical line of Starbursts? I'm, yeah. <laughs> Okay. Sucked in an ice cube and a chunk of pineapple and I just throat closed up. It said for an object. What was, what's that? Uh, it's frozen fruit. Um, it's pretty good. Just tastes like passion fruit pineapple. Little dull, maybe a little dull <laughs> pineapple. Get it? It's okay. I can't tell if I'm picky with my drinks. I'm sure people in the comments have comments about if I'm picky or not with drinks. It's just like when a, when Starbucks or Dunkin' or any place comes out and they're like, brand new drink. They always make it sound like it is an earth shattering best thing you've ever tasted. Once you try it, you'll, you can't get enough of it. And half the time you're like, okay, it's just another thing on the menu. Like, I'm gonna say it, I'm gonna say it. It's prettier than it tastes. If you need like an Instagram picture, so I don't know, something to hold while you show off your nails, get this. It tastes like the pink drink, but pineapple instead of strawberry. Like how it's like, I don't know what they put in the pink drink that it's like cloudy. Starbucks really confuses me. It tastes like an adult juice box. Why is it called a paradise drink? It's March in the Midwest. Paradise? I don't think I like chunks of frozen fruit and drinks with like these sippy lids. Cause you're always just like fighting. You have to close your mouth off and like siphon it through the liquid through your teeth. Remember in Finding Nemo the whale that like all everything passed through like the bristly mouth of the whale. He had to like siphon the fish out of the water and then he spits the water back up. I'm drinking it like this, making sure that I don't choke on a fruit chunk. Now Starbucks put out a mango paradise drink. Oh my God, they had March Madness for basketball. They could have done a March Mango. March Mango Madness. Now it's too late. Now it's gonna be April. You snooze, you lose. Someone from marketing, contact me. Look, I got a piece of pineapple stuck to the sippy lid. There's chunks in the airway. Your doctor talking to you about your clogged arteries. There's chunks in the channels. Do you see that? Those channels are running through your body. Get out of here. I could have asked for no chunks, couldn't I have? But I just order it as is. I go, whatever it says on the menu, I'm gonna say it. Paradise drink, X nay on the chunk A. Is that person peeing against a tree? No. Smoking a cig? Crossing the street? All of the above? I gotta do some editing tonight. I gotta put her gift together. Oh, I gotta FaceTime my friend, which I'm, we never picked a time, but now I'm, looks like I'm gonna be late for it. I'm like, oh, sorry, I was getting, the, I was choking on some chunks. Um, they were going down. They weren't coming up. It wasn't like a throw-up situation. Too much in TMI, DMI, DMI, JFK, LMNOP, QRS, TUV, W. What if, like, <laughs> that would be a funny bit. What if, like, whenever you, like, started word vomiting in a conversation and you just were sharing too much, tripping over your words, my brain just defaults to reciting the alphabet. Yeah, so yesterday I saw that you were watching the game. Well, I didn't, I didn't see you were watching the, It's not like you posted it on social media. I was walking past your house with my dog. You had the blinds open. Like, you guys have never closed your blinds in years. I saw you had the big game on, and then I saw that you're also, like, you. there must have been pizza. But I wasn't, like, wa stalking you from the sidewalk, but, like, it's not like I'm not, like, a superhero, like, the sidewalk stalker. No, I was just really I was walking past your house and I saw that you know that I I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y and Z I'll see myself out <laughs> like a safety switch in your brain just like kick started you into the alphabet or like twinkle twinkle little star or like <laughs> I know you want to get that part in the play because you're sloppy I you I've seen your tap dancing skills okay I've dropped a box of cracker jacks and they've made a better sound I I don't know what you know what to tell you there's only certain people that have what it takes to be a star. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. Up above the world so bright. I don't know the words to the song. Shine inside my room tonight? Twinkle, twinkle, little star. What is the words? How I wonder where you are? No, we're looking at the stars. Won't you climb inside my bed tonight? Like, why do I want to say that? Am I th mixing up songs? What the, f what are the words? Twinkle, twinkle, little star. What you doing where you are? <laughs> is the song just four lines? 
shining in my window tonight? That's too many. The song's about stars, isn't it? Wah, 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 wah. Won't you shine your light? Yeah, right. Is it about my relationship with the stars? Twinkle, twinkle, little stars. Am I looking at the stars? I don't know the words. Bah, bah. What would make sense? Twinkle, twinkle, lit. I got nothing. I can't even be creative. I have nothing. Oh boy, what a sight. <laughs> How I wonder where you are. Well, if you're seeing them twinkle, then you know where they are. And also, they're always going to be in the sky. They're not going to be in the ground. Twinkle, twinkle, little scar. Scar? I'm so confused. I have to look up the lyrics right now. This is a literary mystery. Yeah. Oh, I was, yeah. Twinkle, twinkle, little star. How I wonder what you are. They're stars. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Like a diamond in the sky. Then you show your little light, twinkle, twinkle, all the night. I've never heard the second verse of this song. It's an English lullaby written by Jane Taylor. I'm not that dumb. The English lyrics have five stanzas, although only the first is widely known. It's, how often am I singing this song? I mean, I don't need to know. No, I'm just gonna stop singing it. <laughs> I didn't know, I didn't think this is where this video was going. I never know where the videos go. Part of me thinks I should just, maybe for one day, I should not talk to myself the whole day. Do you think I would implode? Anyways, me, who, oh, I gotta go. This is pretty good. I'm just, I'm, get it without the chunks. It grows on you. It's a slow burn of a drink. Except the chunks. The chunks will never grow on me. I got stuff to do, and I need lotion on these hands. Nails are cute, hands are still dry. You can't have it all. Now, why is there a dog toy in my neighbor's yard if they don't have a dog? Why? I hope you're not just throwing dog toys in your back. Wait, they do have a dog. They have a dog and no fence. Ow, I just stabbed myself in the nostril. Oh, I have a pimple inside my nose. Right inside my nose. And I have the beginning of a canker sore. Am I okay? I just threw up in my mouth a little bit. I think my nose is bleeding now. Ow! Ow! Curse you, fake nails! Oh, I thought someone was standing next to me. I was like, can I help you? <laughs>